Hi everybody, I'm going to show you a few tips for navigating around the PLP hub space that have been really helpful to me. Um, like most of you, I'm a busy teacher and mom, so I, um, I find that when I have to remember to go back in and check things that are happening on the community hub, that's sort of a faulty system for me because I have just so many priorities in a day that I, I forget to do so. So what I've done is set up my Ning settings, my hub settings, so that the uh, my email will actually do the finding for me. So that means that um, instead of me having to remember to go and look and check for things, I'll get emails that notify me when people have made changes on the Ning. So I really only have to go to the hub when I need to, when action is happening. Now this means that I will get a lot of information in my email box and that's okay. I don't feel that I have to read all of it, but it helps me sort of be aware of the activity that's going on and then when I want to check in and, and click a link, I can do so. So the first thing you need to do is make sure that your own settings are set so that you'll get a message. So I'm going to kind of go from from the least amount of um, community information you'll get to the highest. So when you when you first go in here, what you want to do is go over. I'm logged in as Brenda Sherry, so I want to go over here to my Brenda Sherry list, and I want to click on Settings. And when I do that, you sort of see my profile information here. And um, I don't need to change anything that I've set up here on my first page. What I need to do is go over here to email on the left hand side and click email and this will send me some email notifications. So what I'm going to do is ask, I'm actually going to switch this one, I'm going to wait for my email notifications to come in just daily instead of instantly. And I have a lot checked off here being a, a co-leader of a community and a coach. So, but I would suggest that you should have checked off that you want to know when people send you any, a personal message and you want to know when you get a message from the community hub. So that means the office or Cheryl sending you something or will. Um, when one of your groups makes a, posts a message to a group, you want to make sure you get an email that, that um, notifies you. Um, when a message is sent to multiple recipient recipients, when someone comments on your page, this is really important. You want to know that they made that comment, so you want to get a little a little email to tell you. Uh, alerts sent by an app, I don't really have any experience with that one. I have it checked off, but it doesn't influence me too much. I don't know what that means really. Then um, there's some other ones here. I have most of them checked. Um, so you can go through here and, and uh, see what you like. But really, under the activity, you want to make sure that you're, you're getting some emails when activity is happening, especially in your groups or when people um, comment on your own wall, okay? Do not turn off all emails because then you're not going to know what's going on at all. And you'll have to really remember to check in quite often, quite frequently. So I'm going to click Save. All right, and that's my settings, okay? So that's the first level. The next thing I want to make sure I do is go into my pick one. So I'm going to use the IU13 Pennsylvania group as my example here. And you can see that um, there's some message from the community leader, Robin, here, and um, some discussions down at the bottom. Now, I would like to be able to not have to check in here all the time to see if people have posted discussions. I want the, the hub to do the work for me. So I'm going to go down to the end of the discussions and I'm going to go over here where it says view all and I'm going to click on that. Okay, And this is what yours is going to look like. I've reset mine so it would look like yours. You're going to see at the very bottom of all these discussions something that says follow. And what you want to do is click that because you want to get an email when someone posts a new discussion so that you know what's going on and you might want to jump in and, and comment. So I click follow. Then, I, then it says stop following. So that's at the community uh, level. So at your pick one level. Now you can actually go to the main hub if you click on home and you could do the same thing for discussions that are posted to the main hub. So I'm going to go down through, past all this great information on the home page and find the discussion area. Where is it? Here it is. Okay, here are the discussions people are posting. And I'm going to find where my view all is. 
And then I'm going to scroll right down. There's a lot in the main hub. And there's the follow button. I want to click that so that it says stop following. I think this will help you really feel like you're seeing what's going on in the, in the community hub without having to remember to check in all the time. So good luck with that. I hope that helps you. Thanks.